The six row feed barleys are split between the hybrid varieties, such as these two examples here, and conventional types like KWS Amistar or Funky. We're going to start by talking about the hybrid varieties and then have a closer look at KWS Amistar. The first thing you'll notice about these hybrid varieties is that they are a much taller, bigger, more vigorous crop of barley. Uh, and that comes down to the heterosis or hybrid vigour that we get with this breeding technique. Hybrid barleys, such as this one, SY Kingsbarn, will consistently outyield their conventional counterparts. Other advantages of hybrid crops, as I say, are that significant vigour, which allows for later drilling of our hybrid barley varieties and also provide much greater competition to grass weeds. The mainstay of hybrid barley varieties in recent years has been bazooka at the end. Bazooka has been very reliable for us, but last year we had Kingsbarn arrive on the recommended list, bringing with it an increase in yield, an improved grain quality and stiffer straw strength. It's no surprise then that Kingsbarn leapfrogged bazooka last year to become the most widely grown hybrid variety, and we'd expect it to retain that crown this year. Alongside King's Barn, we have this other variety, Kingston, which you can see here looks very similar in terms of its growth habit and its height. Kingston narrowly missed out on recommendation this year, mainly because it's only slightly behind King's Barn on yield. However, those growth characteristics of good stiff straw and bolder grain quality than bazooka make it another viable option for 2020. The other standout feature for Kingston is that this is a particularly early maturing variety. All hybrids tend to be some of the first crops to come to harvest, but Kingston is the earliest of the lot, which again could help us in situations where there's a lot of fields to get harvested and spreading those harvest dates is of benefit. If you're thinking about growing hybrid barley this year, I would urge you to consider your seed variety choice and getting that order placed, because unfortunately there are likely to be shortages in the UK of hybrid barley seed. That's down to a lack of carryover seed from last season, and of course the difficult establishment conditions for our seed crops last autumn. If you have questions about hybrid barley or would like to place a seed order, speak to your frontier farm trader or agronomist. Thank you.